In this video, we paint some oxidized copper. First step, we need copper. So I have some uh, copper metallic shiny paint here and we are going to hit up all of these parts that I want to be metallic copper, which is pretty much everything that would be metallic. So stuff here on the dagger and on the crown and there's some little baubles on the back of the cloak and then I'm trying to get some of this, uh, I don't know, whatever this clothing thing she is wearing, get some of that to be copper as well. There we go. All right, and now we are going to hit this with a wash because there are some interesting details on the dagger and on the crown, and for that wash will be Reichland Flush Shade. So what we think traditionally of rust is actually the oxidization of uh, iron and steel. And then I did my bronze vertigray, which looks kind of bluish. So when copper oxidizes, I think we call it a patina. I don't know all of these terms, but it's actually green. And so I'm going to take this uh, green right here, which I guess, I don't know, is this a lime green or it's kind of a desaturated, a higher value green. And I'm going to dry brush this over uh, the copper details, mostly focusing on the crown and the dagger, but trying to get a little bit of everything else too because I am going with this theme of oxidized metals on all of these night haunts. And so all the Briar Queen's fancy metals are going to be oxidized and oxidized copper is green. I did get a little bit on the dagger here and I'm just gonna leave it because I don't really care that much about tidying it up. Again, just trying to get these guys on the table with an interesting look and some themes. All right, there we go. Oxidized copper, pretty happy with it. And now we're going to do, I think next we're gonna do all of these vines and petals and roses and we'll grab Barclov back and do some work on him and then glowy bits. And then we're gonna be done with the thorns of the Briar Queen. And I'm pretty excited because that means I'm actually gonna play with him again. And I like playing Warhammer Underworlds. That is how I've been hobbying lately. Please let me know how you've been hobbying lately down in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to get daily hobby videos, consider subscribing. If you want a preview of my next painting video, check out my Rumble. I do the occasional blog post related to the channel over on my Tumblr, and you can also follow me on Instagram.